the Karnataka government, wherein they were going to provide toolkits for uh, SCST students who had dropped out of school and so that they can be trained to find employment. Uh, in response to that, uh, Minister C. N. Ashwath Narayan has made a statement saying that forget about corruption, I have actually saved 5.27 crores for the government, which is a, it is not because of saving money to the government, but to take a bigger commission that the retendering was done. Suddenly after retendering in two months time, they are showing some fake documents saying that they have done 33 crores business. So this is a complete fake company. Uh, it's called Intellect Systems. Intellect Systems is the same company which was um, involved in this scandal regarding laptops wherein a laptop which was earlier purchased for 14,000, a very similar laptop was then purchased for 28,000 rupees. Now we have to give you 90% proof in your documents. You can give you a proof in your documents. You can give you a document in your documents. मुख्यमंत्री अपना पीड़िते तितो दिशते बात को समय दो बोल करे दक्षिणा फर्स्ट तो नहीं हो अश्वत नारायण अपना वजह मणि पृथ्वी रेड्डी आप लीडर सेस अश्वत नारायण स्टेट मिनिस्टर शुड बी सैक्ट फॉर चीटिंग पीपल विथ करप्शन he said that the minister must be removed for his involvement in corruption in relation to distribution of toolkit to SCST students. As per the conditions of the tender, the company should have the ability to procure 30% of the recruitment. The document shared by the company is fake and this is evident on the GST portal. Why the ministers and officials of the department have not questioned this is the biggest question, said Prithvi Reddy. Surprisingly, the same company was involved in another controversy a couple of months back. Laptops, which should have been procured for Rs 14,000, were bought at Rs 24,000 by the government, causing huge loss to government's exchequer. We exposed a scam relating to the skill building uh, initiative of the Karnataka government, wherein they were going to provide toolkits for uh, SCST students who had dropped out of school and so that they can be trained to find employment. Um, what had happened was that uh, there was an initial tender which was cancelled and then a new tender was given. And when we found out and dug a little deeper, it was found that uh, there was a lot of uh, uh, irregularities in that. So we exposed it about three days ago. In response to that, uh, Minister C. N. Ashwat Narayan has made a statement saying that forget about corruption, I have actually saved 5.27 crores for the government, which is a big lie. And we came here today to expose that lie. Because the reason the first tender was cancelled had nothing to do with money, it had to do with the fact that though the cabinet had approved only 17 crores, the department, the commissioner had uh, accepted the higher value and was ready to give the tender. However, the secretary made a comment saying that there is only one company that has qualified. So because of the single tender uh, requirement, I mean multiple, that's not acceptable, that's why they had a retender. Now, it is not because of saving money to the government, but to take a bigger commission that the retendering was done is our uh, uh, claim and we have produced documents to prove that because the company which got disqualified in the first tender, suddenly because they didn't have sufficient qualification in terms of business volume in those particular products, um, that company suddenly after re-tendering in two months time, they are showing some fake documents saying that they have done 33 crores business. We have proved how those documents are fake. The company which they have, they claim to have sold 22 crores worth of mechanical products, what is used in mechanical workshop, drills, iron blocks, things like that is actually an IT company. Uh, that IT company has not only issued a purchase order, they have given an endorsement in the back saying that we have received these goods. Uh, when we check the GST portal, when they are claiming to have purchased 22 crores worth of goods, they have in reality purchased only 5 lakhs worth of goods. So this is a complete fake company. Uh, it's called Intellect Systems. Intellect Systems is the same company which was um, involved in this scandal regarding laptops wherein a laptop 
which was earlier purchased for 14,000, a very similar laptop, was then purchased for 28,000 rupees, uh, causing a loss to the exchequer of almost 200 plus crores. So our demand is very clear that Mr. Bommai has to immediately seek the resignation of Mr. Uh, Ashwat Narayan. Um, within a week's time, he should either order a judicial probe or a CBI probe. Uh, if not, we will hit the streets, we will expose this government and we will also approach the court because we have sufficient proof to show the involvement of Mr. Ashwat Narayan in this whole issue.